What's going on this morning, guys? It is 6 o'clock in the morning right now. I don't know why I'm so tired this morning because I hardly got any sleep last night. But uh, I've got the yak ready to roll. I'm going to a lake today with you, buddy. We're not bringing the boat today just because of uh, some complications with that. But uh, yeah, I'm all ready to go. I've got to go get my tackle inside in my lunch bag that I'm. Alright, rock and roll, guys. I'm really looking forward to this. I think it'll be a good day. Um, he knows the lake, like I said, really, 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 really well. And I've only fished there one time, so. Looking forward to it. And again, I'm sorry I'm fried this morning, but hope you all enjoy this episode. Stay tuned. Oh, you're nice. I'm having a great morning today. Great morning, Matt. Great job. Stupid. Just come out. Of course. Come on, slouch on it, boy. Oops. Did I just do that? I thought. I've had that happen so many times. You're free, it's just your, uh, your island's gone off. I'm so retarded. Oh my gosh. I'd take your, your rod and put in the other rod holder, yeah. Yeah. I have to do that too. That's why, Matt, since I'm right handed, I yeah, have yeah. my rod on the left side, my second rod. Because oh, I yeah. snap a rod doing that. And I never did it again. Trying to untangle it myself, though. It's a little bit tangled here. Those are the new officers. What? What's up everybody? Hope you all have enjoyed this video thus far. There's been near to none um, of me recording. I've hardly recorded anything, um, which is my personal fault. But uh, I want to apologize for that. But um, we have caught fish. Um, I will sh roll a picture of the one fish I have caught. It was a smallmouth. Here it is. Um, it was about a pound, probably 12 or 13 inches long. So, I mean, it was a good fish. And I can't complain about it at all. But really, with the water temperature, the water temperature is around 60 degrees. The fish should have been biting more. Um, we were fishing these rock um, rock piles, basically. Um, there's like these. Um, there's okay, so we're fishing Elm Creek. There's marina. There's like all these all these uh, levees with rocks all on them. You know, there's, if you've ever been to Elm Creek, you know what I'm talking about. But smallies love rock, as many of you guys know. And we were fishing those and. He caught one largey off of this. I mean, but I can't. I really can't complain. I mean, I I had a blast today. Nevertheless, fishing with, um, fishing with my buddy and everything. It was a lot of fun. I cannot complain whatsoever because I really did have a lot of fun. But I'm just talking about fishing here. We should have caught more fish. I mean, there should have been. I mean, I thought the fish were just going to be jumping in the boat because he nailed one first or second cast and. I, mean, I wasn't nailing any, I was using basically the same bait as him and everything, and I was like, I mean, I guess, guess not, you know, and we fished for like three hours, and, but yeah, and then I got frustrated, so, yeah, that's, I'm going to, it is like, it is, what is it, it's 12.13 right now, so it's, I still have basically all day. Um, however, I've got a bunch of appointments to go to, so this is going to be, I know I, I say this basically every, every single video, but this is actually going to be a combined video of today and tomorrow. We're going to be fishing from the boat in which, I don't know, for those of you who've been, um, keep trying to keep updated and everything, I think I said something in my last video, and for those of you who follow me on Instagram and Facebook, you know that I have been working on a John boat with a buddy of mine, and we are hoping to take it out on the lake for the very, very, very first time. I've taken it out on a farm pond and caught a couple bluegill and bass on it and everything, 
But I want to take it out on the lake and everything. And so I'm hoping, hoping we can do that. But uh, before we roll into the next clip, I just wanted to show you guys, as I'm hitting everything with this, what I caught that fish on. So basically this is a, I'm using a 7 foot rod. Um, this is 10 uh, pound test fluorocarbon on here. I don't even know why. I had it pegged. I had that from a text track. I just forgot to take it off. But this is basically, I don't even remember what brand this is, but this is my little crankbait here. Not a deep diver at all, but it just worked perfect. Uh, using that on a 7 foot medium heavy rod. So, uh, got the job done today for sure. And, uh, yeah. So, without further ado, this next clip that you're about to see is... Um, hopefully going to be either at a lake or a river. The river is possibly going to be super, super, super high. So I don't know if we're going to fish it because I don't want to get dangerous. And I really, really want to try out the John boat. However, tomorrow Saturday. And for those of you who fish from boats, you know how freaking busy everything is on weekends. Especially with speed boats and everything. We were getting demolished today by, by speed boats. Even though it's 60 degrees out and rainy. It's cold. Very, very windy. So, very, very confusing why there are so many people out there. But, yeah. Without further ado, hope you all enjoy this next clip. I don't know if it's going to be the river or if it's going to be a lake. So, make sure you all pay attention. You all are in for as much of a surprise as I am. Well, I'm back in the room again. Um, sorry about my hair. This is like almost a week after that last clip was filmed. Um, wasn't even going to post this video, but, uh, decided, you know, heck, why not? Um, because I have an idea of what I'm going to do just to add to the video a little bit. Um, again, when we went out to Elm Creek, me and my buddy Gabe, we caught fish. Um, I think I have a picture of... I don't, I, yeah, I don't even have a picture of the fish we caught. I'm so stupid. But anyways, we caught fish that day. And, um, really, it was a good day. I just, I brought the cameras and stuff. And I, I took some cool pictures that I'll probably post on the Instagram if you guys follow me on there. So stay tuned for those. But, I don't know. It's, it was just kind of trying out the new boat. There was a lot of little ton of boats out there because the weather is beautiful out and the fish are spawning and stuff so I mean obviously there's going to be a lot of bass fishermen out there that day so really in essence it was uh it was kind of uh, one of those days where I just didn't want to pick up a camera so yeah I have an idea though this next clip is going to be a clip of my little brother and I um, trying out the John boat for the very first time on a small farm pond, and I have a bluegill. Um, we were fishing for bluegill, and I caught one. And it was the first ever fish that was ever caught on the boat, which is pretty exciting, so y'all can see the boat um, while we're on it. Um, yeah, enjoy it, and yeah, I'll see y'all right after that clip. Find some, boys. Got the first fish. This is a nice little bluegill. That's pretty much all I'm going to be fishing for today is bluegill. Um, because there's some big bluegill in here. Thank you, buddy. First fish of this boat. That's awesome. Let's freaking go. Ah, uh, guess what, Ben? My hands smell like fish for four years. <laughs> Let's go. So, this is going to be the end of the video because guess what like I said a billion times I did not film very much so I hope y'all enjoyed it thank y'all so much for watching make sure you guys click that subscribe button and uh, give this video a thumbs up if y'all enjoyed it I know it was kind of a boring video I don't even know if it's going to be over 10 minutes long so we'll see but hope y'all enjoy it hope y'all have a beautiful rest of your day today and uh, keep fishing you know catch them big old bass right now it is they are spawning here in central ohio and i've already broken my pb and i caught a six pounder which was awesome um super super excited to continue to break 
my PVs over the next few years and my entire life. So, hope you all enjoyed this video again. Make sure you give it a thumbs up, as I said before. And uh, subscribe if you all enjoy this content. We'll see you.